Hi everybody, thank you so much for watching. Today's video is going to be my March favorites, as you can tell by the title. I have some beauty products and some hair and body stuff and then a random clothing item, so let's just get into the video. Okay, the first beauty items I'm going to share with y'all are two blushes. The first blush is by Tarte and it is the 12 hour Amazonian clay blush and this is in the color Tipsy. It's just a gorgeous corally orange color and it looks really beautiful with a natural eye when you're just wanting to have a really pretty blush color on your cheeks, a really pretty pop of color. So I love this color for spring and summer. It's so beautiful and it goes on smoothly and it doesn't um, get splotchy on your cheeks or anything and I love that about a blush. And then this is the Smashbox blush in the color Heartbreak. And I think I have mentioned this before, but I'm not sure. It's just a pinky rose color, and um, I'm wearing it today, so it's just a really pretty natural pink color. So I love both of these, and they both go on so beautif beautifully onto your cheeks. I have a lip product, and I have talked about this before. I think I mentioned it in my last video, or I mentioned a different color, but this is the NYX Butter Gloss in Angel Food Cake. This is my favorite butter gloss by NYX. It's just a beautiful pink. It's just like the perfect natural lip color, and it's so pretty and so glossy and smells amazing, and it's not sticky or anything. It just goes on so pretty on your lips. Love this color so much. Um, a foundation that I have been loving is by Tarte as well, and it is the Amazonian Clay 12 Hour Full Coverage Foundation. And um, I got this off of their website, so I kind of had to guess on what my color was, and I don't see the color name on here, but it's like light sand or um, light pink. I don't know. It's like a pink undertone, I think, but it is just so gorgeous. I'm wearing it today as well, and it's just, I don't even, oh, it says right here, light neutral. Sorry, it's in a weird print. Anyway. Um, I love the way this goes onto my skin. Um, I have never had a problem with it breaking up like some um, liquid foundations. And this is more of like a really thick whipped consistency. And I think it's just so pretty. And I've had this since December, but I recently started wearing it a lot um, as it's gotten kind of um, warmer outside. And I really love the way it wears. And I especially love, um, well, where is it? Here it is. I especially love to wear or put it on with my Sigma F80 Kabuki brush. So these go so beautifully together and I highly recommend this foundation if you're looking for a new foundation and you just want something really light and natural looking. It's not, it's full coverage, but it looks so light on the skin and you cannot even tell that you're wearing it. So I love this foundation. I have an eyeliner. This is the by L'Oreal. It's the Infallible Black Buster Liquid Eyeliner, and it is a gigantic marker, as you can see, and you can do like um, a skinny line, or you can do like a thick marker line, and it reminds me of exactly of a marker, but I love the way that you have control with this because the tip is so large, but it has the skinny little tiny tip on it. It's just so easy to just draw on your eyeliner. So it's really easy for y'all that are looking for something easy to apply. Maybe you're not as good as good at eyeliner as you want to be. So this is a great um, product if you're just starting out and it is so black and it does not fade at all. And I just really like this. And I really have not heard of anybody talking about this, but I do like this eyeliner a lot. I highly recommend it. I have a couple more items. This is the First Aid Beauty Ultra Repair Cream, and I've been using this as a moisturizer on your on my face, but you can use it on um, your arms or your legs or your elbows or anywhere you have some dry patches. This is great for eczema, it says, and it says you can use it on the face. So I wanted to try this out. I got this in a little set. It came with a cleanser and some um, radiance pads, but I really love this um, moisturizer and I can definitely tell when I wake up in the morning that my face is really um, moisturized and hydrated and it's not dry or anything. So I love this moisturizer and I use this at night. I don't use this in the morning, but I do use this at night. And the last beauty product is this palette by Wet n Wild and this is the Comfort Zone palette. I have had this for a year or so and I absolutely love it. I kind of put it away when I started getting more higher in um, 
makeup palettes or eyeshadow palettes but this is a gorgeous gorgeous palette and the colors are so pigmented I mean look at that dark brown color like they're just so dark so like they're just so soft and creamy and pigmented and they're so gorgeous so if you were, are looking for a natural eye palette I highly recommend this one by Wet n Wild I think it's two or three ninety nine at the drugstore Walmart. A couple weeks ago I pulled it out and I started wearing it more and I could notice that the eyeshadows just blended so beautifully together and I just cannot say enough good words about them. They remind me of the Lorac um, eyeshadows a lot so I love my Lorac palette as y'all know but this is just a great palette and I thought I would share it with y'all that are looking for a really cheap natural looking um, eyeshadow palette. A hair product that I have been liking is the Paul Mitchell Express Hold Me Tight Finishing Spray. I actually found this at Target and it was on sale for $8.98. It was originally $17.99 so I wanted to get this and it is not really a hairspray. I use it as a hairspray. I use it after I have finished doing my hair and then I set it with a hairspray afterwards but it just smells so good and it's so light and I feel like it just really holds my curls really well and if you have straight hair I'm sure it will just hold the way that you want your hair to be fixed so really like this spray and if you would like to get this look at your target because they have a clearance they usually have like a little clearance section on the end of an aisle and that's where I found this and I was so excited to find this and they had a bunch of good stuff on the end of that aisle so definitely check that out. And then one more thing I have been absolutely loving this Pure Paradise the Pure Paradise in general it's by um, Bath and Body Works this is just a smell and I have it in this lotion I've been using I took it on me on vacation um, last week but it just smells so good I don't think it tells like what the smell is but it's just so light and smells amazing and it has it smells like the beach that's what it reminds me of so I guess that's why I like it so much but it just smells so good and I have a like a mist in this scent and I have body lotion and body gels and everything like that shower gels so I love this scent I don't know how to describe it to you so just go to Bath and Body Works and smell it and you will just know how good it smells okay that is all of the beauty stuff beauty skincare makeup and um I have one more clothing favorite and the last favorite I have is a clothing favorite and they are these little shoes right here. These are called the Sanook Yoga Sling and they are made with a yoga mat on the bottom and so they are so incredibly comfortable. So comfy. I cannot even explain to you how comfortable they are. But you, it, they're kind of weird because like they have a thing that attaches right here and then they have this little sling that you slip between that and that's how it holds your foot in so you just put your foot in right there and then this goes behind your ankle or your heel so I love these shoes I've been wearing them almost every day that it's been warm because they're so comfortable they come in tons and tons of colors but um, I just got these at a little store in the mall and they were kind of limited on their colors but I did know I wanted black because you can just wear black with everything so they had this black and gray stripe in pairs and I thought they were so cute so I got these and I might end up getting like a pink or a blue or something like that so I love these shoes I will link them down below if I can find them on the website or something like that but they have been selling out like crazy at my local store and so if you want some you better go get some because they're really popular right now because they just come out I believe so love these shoes and I recommend them if you have if you're on your feet a lot and you can wear flip-flops or whatever so comfortable so that concludes my March favorites I didn't have a lot of stuff but I thought I had some good stuff that I haven't shown before so I always like getting new products and trying them out and telling y'all what I think thank you so much for watching and I hope you enjoyed seeing all of my favorites from this month and if you liked this video please like it and um, subscribe to my channel if you have not already thank you so much for watching bye